Hey, what's up guys? Phoenix here, and this video is going to be a highlight from a live stream that happened previously. If you don't want to miss the next live stream next time I go live, then go to the Twitch link in the description down below and follow the page and enable notifications so you get notified next time I go live. Alternatively, if you want, there's a Discord link in the description as well for the channel's Discord server. I always announce when I'm live streaming over there, as well as pop in and chat on a day-to-day -day basis. So if you're interested in either of those two links, then they are definitely there for you to use. Alternatively, if you like this sort of stuff and you want to see more stuff like it, be sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and maybe leave a comment down below with a deck you maybe want to see me play on a future live stream that might make its way to video form if you want me to test a certain deck. So definitely leave feedback below, but with that out of the way, take care guys, see you in the next one, and enjoy the video. Is there a good way to play Dragoons with Guard Dragons? Not until, uh, not until Romulus comes out. Because right now the only Dragon Link that we're getting uh, that provides the proper arrows to make Sinidus a good starter card is uh is the hieratic link and it doesn't allow you to do a lot yeah pot of greed whoa if Wait. All right. I still have no idea how you could do jujitsu when you literally just gnawed off your leg. I imagine jujitsu is a very leg-involved mixed martial art. <laughs> We're getting retribution, big boys, because we have the Selene. This card searches a lot. Actually. Actually just searches a lot. We have Sanctum? Boo! We have Sanctum. You just have to message those to either Victory Flare or Rob Keck. Um, okay. Just a thought. You don't have to. But just make sure you're using your Twitch Prime somewhere. Make sure you're using it somewhere. If you know a family member that has a Twitch Prime, make sure that they're using it somewhere. Because, like... Jeff Bezos is his divorce. We don't need to give that man or his woman any more money. And it's just a free subscription for you. So use it somewhere. Doesn't have to be here. Just make sure you use it somewhere. Hmm. Almost forgot I had the Sanctum. Literally almost forgot I had the Sanctum. I was like wondering where I'm going to use my Surzeal and where I'm going to use my Ogre. But I have a Sanctum set. <laughs> <sighs> Alright. Does this affect during the next standby phase activate? Asking for a friend. Once returning during the next standby phase after this effect was activated, colon. I guess it does. Hmm. Okay. I'll just wait for the pen call. Oh, that's a star pendulum graph. Never mind. I guess we'll negate that then. We have the ogre too. Uh, I'll negate that. I was kind of waiting for pen call, but that'll work too. Scythe. Oh. 
I see. <laughs> I see. All right. Okay, cool. All right. Um, so I take five. Man, he really got me, Duelist. But Ogre outs this card, so... Because it doesn't bounce his cost. Smile. Um, so, we can go ahead and use Medusa to add back... Um, we could use Medusa to add back Retribution and set it. Or we could use Serzial to search Retribution and set it. We'll use this, because if we summon Serzial next turn, we can get Selene and put that on the Medusa if it survives. Uh, F. So, adding the Retribution to hands. And now, uh, Selene resolves, giving this guy more attack. Uh, so this Selene has this thing at 26 now. Very nice. We just need to activate one more card and we're bigger than this Apex Avion. But wait, there's more. We don't need to. We have no need to do that. You know why? Because this was Tribute Summons. So we can't target it with Serzial. So yes, we in fact do have to wait. How irritating it must be. But it's okay, because we can just out that at any time we want. We'll just pass. The fuck is this? Cry of a nation. I. So. He's looking at his extra deck. He thinks he's going to get us, right? He thinks he's going to get us. But what he's going to find very soon is that it is us that is going to get him um hmm uh field f field f we both take the damage is that that activates too right does that activate yeah it does uh so I take 500, and then this gets bigger. Because it has a colon, so it activates. It's a trigger effect that triggers when that happens. It says you can make. So you physically have to choose to activate it. Am I, am I interpreting this right? Once per turn, during damage calculation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 You can only activate one evil eye per turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now we go this, uh-huh, then we normal this, uh, F, so I take five, and this gets bigger, and I get another evil eye card. Oh, if you activate an evil eye spell or trap card, you right. Okay, well then I, then I, I'm just gonna keep the life points as they are. I don't really care about that, but I'm just gonna remove the counter so the attack points don't matter. I'll I'll just be at a negative 500 deficit. That's fine. This only destroys one. That's kind of irritating. But you know what? Sure. <laughs> sure. Uh, we'll go ahead and activate this. Destroying this. And then now is where the 500 takes place. Ah, he is scooping. I see. So am I going second? More than likely. Uh, what the hell do I do going second against this deck? I don't side in Electromite, so I guess this can come out. Um... For that. Ugh. Oh. This is not very well built for going second against the Pandalum deck. 
Uh, but we could at least side these. So we'll do that. And we'll put in a strike. Because with the Gozen matches and the There Can Only Be Ones and the strikes, those, those, those serve as board clearing cards. Does this deck put two Dark Monsters on the field? I don't think it does. He's playing Apex Avion as well. So he's probably just going to sit on that instead of making other extra deck negations. Look at this. This hand's pretty aight. Aw, oh, he didn't even have the Dark Worm. He's not even good enough to have the Dark Worm, chat. Not even good enough. It's easy. This opponent's free. He's not even good enough to have the Dark Worm. Nice. What is this? What band is this? UDD. Why have I never heard of this band? <laughs> Adding the star pendulum graph. What do you add off the pendulum called? Black Fang and Oof. Alright. Wow. Not even Electromite before the Pendulum Summon? Wow, man. Oh, you drew the nut. You drew the donut. Oh, you got another copy of this, though, so that's pretty aight. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, I put in the Solemn Warning. That's not what I should be putting. Did I just not put in the Third Strike and I put in the Solemn Warning instead? Chat. That can't be how this goes. That can't be, that can't be how we go out. It can't be. Did I click on the third on the warning instead of the third strike? Or are all four of them in my deck? All four of them might be in my deck. But so, I've been messing around with Dragoonities. With dual power, with the Hieratic Link coming out. Its effect isn't really that relevant anymore because we have the guard dragons. Um, but the guard dragon, it's like the only dragon that gives you the proper arrows to resolve your guard dragons in the way you want to resolve them. But it makes all your combos three card combos. Now, granted, those combos are like Ravine plus two tuners, or Ravine plus Senatus plus tuner, Ravine plus uh, Zephyros tuner, Ravine plus Dark Worm tuner, Ravine plus Dark Worm Senatus. Like, it's super open ended in terms of like, there's like, every combo has like any combo with two cards can swap out the third card for any card in the deck in terms of like a monster extender but uh but like the three card combos whereas once we get romulus uh it becomes two card combos and then we also need the red eyes link uh to keep them a two card combo that makes three negations uh if we don't have the red eyes link then we have to again make them three card combos just to make Sir Yuja so that we can draw four and put three back. And then that offsets the extra card that you put into the combo. So he uses Harmonizing and his Purple Poison to make Electromite. Leaving the Nut on the field. And then off of Star Pendulum Graph, he, uh, he added Wisdom Eye to his hand. And then he put a Jackal King into his extra deck. Now he's adding Jackal King to his hand. And now Oaf is adding back Harmonizing. And now he's passing turn. <laughs> Powerful! Hey, girl, you late to the party. All right, Nadir. How you doing? How was your stream? How are you doing? Okay, I know every card in his hand. It's a Wisdom Eye, a Jackal King, and a Harmonizing, so we're not even going to wait for hand trap responses. Nadir, this deck sucks. Can I tell you about how this deck sucks? This deck's terrible. This deck fucking sucks, but we're like, what, 2 or 3 0 with it right now? It's a bad deck, but damn. Sometimes it just works. Sometimes it just fucking works. Uh, well, let's see. What are we adding here? We're adding Celine, yeah? Celine Dion? There we are. Uh, so we can activate this. We could pot a duality for something else. Yeah, we'll go ahead and do this. Woo! Uh. 
Uh, I guess we had this. So it's top to top. Shuffle. I could have told you that for free. I mean, once it gets going, it's pretty good. It's it's literally a worse Gruber control deck. It's it's pretty all right, but it's a worse Gruber control deck. Um, so we got this. Uh, uh, S Jesus, Sirs F. We'll destroy this. Uh, so that's gone. And now we have. Jesus Christ, a floodgate and a warning and two hand traps. Loud! Um, but so this gains five and I lose 500 life. Uh, but then it attacks for 21. That's pretty nice. Uh, and then during the next standby phase, I have to destroy a card, so I'll just destroy the field spell. Uh, Sirs FSP. Uh, so this dies, I get another counter, and I lose another 500 life. At least that's how I think that works. Because it's a trigger effect. I don't know if it actually triggers the Selene. But I'm assuming that it does. I've got Gozen match in against this deck. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll ash that. I've got the Retribution. Um, okay, cool. You'll pend as many as you can. You've got a handful of Pendulum Monsters, and you're going to get Warnings. He's left the duel! Boys! Alright, this deck's kind of cool. This deck's kind of aight. <laughs> We're 3-0? 4-0? What are we? 